Divine Masculines, how are you guys doing? It's your girl Twin D and I am here to do your reading. Thank you guys for stopping by. Thank you all you Divine Feminines who are supporting this channel also and thank you for the Divine Masculines who are here and also supporting this channel. Thank you guys for also supporting my original channel Twin D, my daughter's channel Kelly Sub and just thank you overall i really appreciate you guys okay guys let's jump into your reading let's see what these feminines have to say to their divine masculines it is gonna be message from messages from the feminine this morning let's go guys our father who art in heaven hallowed be thy name thy kingdom come then will be done on earth as it's in heaven give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Okay, guys, let's jump in because we have a lot of feminines who want to say something. It's like they're just lining up to say something. And these are big guys. I can't even shuffle. So I have to shuffle them like this the best I can. See what these feminines have to say guys oh you're not my ex and I am not your ex oh divine masculines are some of you guys thinking that this person your divine feminine will be the same like your ex are you thinking that things will work out the same like it was with the person the last person you were with well, Divine Masculine, here's your reassurance. You're not my ex, and I am not your ex. Things will not be the same. It's not easy feeling the way I do about you, knowing I can't have you. Wow, these, these feminines are really talking deep, deep, from deep down in their soul. Some of the, these divine feminines here, they, they're masculines. You, you masculines, it's like you're in a connection here and your divine feminines, they're saying to you that it's not easy for them because they're so in love with you, but knowing that you're with someone else and that they can't have you. See, I love you so much. Huh. I wish you knew how much I think about you. So it's over some more. I want one more. How can I let you go when you are all that's on my mind? And Divine Masculines, I know you're feeling the same way too. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm just, I'm just feeling this energy and the, the Divine Feminine, it's like they're really, they're really, not heartbroken, but disappointed. Disappointed that they have found such love within you, Divine Masculine, but yet still they can't do anything with the love. They can't give it to you. They can't express it to you. And they can't show you. But they really do love you. On the bottom it says, through prayer, I am protecting you from lower energies. 444. Oh yes, that's true. 444. Underneath that it says, I am your king and you are my queen. 
No, you're my king and I am your queen. Oh my lord. Well, anyway it goes. <laughs> anyway it goes because we do have um we do have women who are divine masculines. And we do have men who are divine feminines, so it can go either way. But these divine feminines, they are feeling, well, I can't even describe it. Just down, just low. Not that they're sad, but the thought of not being able to express themselves to you, being cut off from you, not having you where they are at. What can you tell me in regards to these divine feminines, please? Communication. See, I told you that they, they, they're not getting any communication. And they need some communication from the Divine Masculine. They don't know how to communicate to you. They don't know how to talk to you. They don't know how to reach you because you're here somewhere else to the Divine Feminine. You seem so abundant where you are, so happy, so contented. But we all know that's not true. See, they are so sad, these Divine Feminines, the way that they're feeling. The Five of Coins, Five of Pentacles. Let's put these here. They're feeling so insecure within themselves. Because they're feeling like maybe I'm not good enough for this person. What about me? That makes him think that I am the same as the person that he was with. What about me? That makes him feel like he wouldn't want to be with me. And they're putting up a defense, the seven of wands. They're putting up a defense. So they're not only feeling sad, but they're going to be putting up a defense. Some of these divine feminines are coming into, into, into powers. Psychic powers. Ability to see things to hear things, to understand things before they even see it. There is something new that's coming in, something that has to do with their mind. It's like they are going within and they're, they're really changing from within. Working on their thoughts, their emotions. Working on themselves. Getting ready to reap the fruits of their reward. So some divine feminines here know that there's a reward that's on their way for them. That's why they're working on themselves so hard on the top balance is coming in and they know this how else can you tell me about these divine feminines and their feelings please how are they feeling please 
or what's going on? Autumn. Somebody said something during the autumn time. Why this person here thinks that you think that they and their and your ex are the same. Something was said, something was done. Maybe you guys separated then. Or that could be a time when you guys met. Don't rush, you'll spoil the cake. Don't rush. Divine masculines, don't rush. I know you want to be with your divine feminine. Within a month, guys, within a month, transformation is taking place. So that's why you shouldn't rush. Let transformation take its place. Let that change occur within you, divine masculine. Within your life, within your situation. Let your situation unfold naturally. Don't rush. See, hello summer. Something's definitely gonna happen in the summertime. What else can you tell me, please? Okay, take it. Say, take it. Take it. You can't run from this. This is your purpose, guys. This is your journey. That's your purpose to be with the divine feminine. Make time to play and relax. You can't be working all the time. You work all the time. What do you what do you achieve from what you're working for? What are you building with the money that you work? What are you building? See? What are you building with the money that you work? You work, you have money, but you're still out in the cold. Because where you are, you, you aren't even happy where you are. You're just there because of addictions. Maybe you just don't want to be alone. You just want to be close to someone. You just, you're just in that connection for sexual pleasures. But you're definitely not happy Divine Masculine is where you are at, just like the Divine Feminine. But you gotta let it play out. Don't rush, just like the Feminine, don't rush. You spoil the cake. But make time to play and relax, guys. All work and no play makes Jack a dollar boy. Let's get you some messages here from my God deck. Let's see what he would want to say to you, Divine Masculines. What messages do you have for the Masculines, please? Start thinking more positively. Change your thoughts. Respect is a foundation of love. Divine Masculine, so if you are not getting that respect where you are at, then there is no love. There is no love. When you're with someone, you will know if they love you because they will respect you. They will respect your thoughts. They will respect your actions. They will, they will respect your wishes. They will respect your peace. Respect your happiness. They would respect anything that would make you happy. And if you're the breadwinner and you're still being so down and unhappy, what's going on there? What's going on there? You don't feel love when you come home. Because this is all that you're there for. The finances. Pay attention to synchronicities happening in your life. Divine Masculines, you may be new to this, but you're seeing signs and synchronicities, and that's anything that's repeating in your everyday life. You may be seeing your Divine Feminine's name, their initials. 
You may be seeing numbers repeating 111, 222, 333, 888, 999. You may be seeing something that your Divine Feminine likes over and over and over. Look at the bottom here. He or she loves you. This person truly loves you. Well, pay attention to those signs and synchronicities. They are leading you to where you need to be, to where you will find true happiness, to where your soul can be happy. Get rid of anger, Divine Masculines. If you have anger issues, get rid of anger. That's why you shouldn't rush either. Because when things don't seem to be working out the way you want it to, so you can get away from your situation, don't rush. Transformation is taking place. And put that ego aside, Divine Masculine. Stop trying to do things just because of your ego. Don't stay where you are because of your ego. Don't hurt the feminine because of your ego. Don't hurt the Divine Feminine because you want to please the people around you. Look at the bottom again. He or she loves you. You see that? That's pure love. I know my self-worth. Know your self-worth too, Divine Masculines. Get out of your ego. That's what's holding you back. You're scared of what people are going to say about you if you should leave the connection where you're at. If you should stop going to that job that you hate so much. That's you living your life for others. No wonder you're so unhappy. Because you're living your life to please others when you should be living it to please yourself. And if you're living your life to please yourself and you're getting no respect for it, then that's not love. Let's get you a Romance Angel card. Getting to know each other, Divine Masculines. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. So there's going to come a time where you and your Divine Feminine are going to have this talk. You're going to have a, a healthy talk. You'll be bonding. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. So stop holding back Divine Masculines. Heal, the, see? Heal those issues that you have there. Get rid of them. Recapture romance, allow inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. Because you don't even you're not even um having any fun where you are at right now. Look, deception. Someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship, and that's it. There's someone who is being fake in your connection. Respect is a foundation of love. That's why that card came out. You aren't getting you are not getting any respect. Someone is hiding their two intentions in your connection. Give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. Pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. You know, you see. You have been giving your relationship a chance, the one that you're in. But you are, you know you're being deceived. You know it. You can see it. You can feel it. So pay attention to the red flags, divine masculines, you see them. And the signs, you see the signs and synchronicities, pay attention to them, they are cautioning you. You are getting signs that that's leading you towards your divine feminine. And you're also getting signs from the situation that you're in, which does show you that you're not meant to be there, you're not meant to stay there. But you keep giving that relationship a chance, giving it a chance. Heart to heart conversation. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. <laughs> G 
gifts from God, Divine Masculines. Archangel Sandalphon. We angels bring you gifts from your Creator. Open your arms to receive. Your Divine Feminine is your gift. Open your arms and receive it. Stop denying it. You can't run from this. This is your destiny. It's hard to understand. But once you understand what this Twin Flame journey is about, then you'll understand and know that this is, a, this is your gift. Your gift of happiness that you long for so much. That you prayed for. That you wish for. And now that it's here, you're trying to run away. Crystal clear intentions, Archangel Michael. Be clear about what you desire and focus upon it with unwavering faith. Yep, because it's your gift. It's your gift. And God, they will help you. God and the angels will help you to get organized, to sort your life out, to get you out of situations you're not supposed to be in so you can be put in the right situation. You can be placed, better word, in the right situation. You are safe. I am protecting you against lower energies and guarding you, your loved ones, and home. That's because your divine feminine has been praying for you. You did get the card that they were praying for your guidance from lower energies. Divine order, divine masculine. Everything is how it needs to be right now. Look past the illusion and see underlying order. That's why you shouldn't rush. That's why you shouldn't rush. Oh, I love these cards at the back. Look. Breathe. Take several deep breaths and exhale slowly to awaken your energy and to release old patterns. Release those old ways of thinking. Take back your power, divine masculines. Stop using your ego to think. Think with your heart. Take back your power. Use your God-given power and intention to manifest blessings into your life. Your gift. The way you want your life to be. The happiness you want to feel manifested into your life. Take care of yourselves, everyone. Love you all. Bye. Don't forget to hit that notification bell so you'll be notified whenever I post new videos. Take care, guys.